All right, guys. Again, my name is Hayden. I'm going to admit everybody in here. We got 85 people on here, 86, 87 people. We got a lot going on. If it's laggy, sorry, honestly, that's the internet. That's how it is. I can't do anything about that right now. So guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop as much content as I possibly can in the next hour for you. I'm going to ask or answer as many questions as I possibly can as well. So make sure to leave the comments in the group chat right here. Leave a enter one if you guys can hear me. Enter one if you can hear me right now. Okay. Okay, perfect. Sounds good. Enter one if you can hear me. Again, my name's Hayden. Okay, awesome. Guys, all right, let's dive on into this. We're going to get going. Again, my name's Hayden. I'm going to teach you how to make as much money in the wholesale market as you possibly can right now. We're going to dive on into this. Ask any questions you have. I'm going to start off, though, by talking about how you can acquire new clients on LinkedIn. That is our goal um, on this conversation. And then on top of that, I'm going to show you a couple other ways that you can acquire new clients. So we have thousands of clients all throughout the world. Tyson, man, change your audio up, up top as well to see if you can right up here in the mute section. <clears throat> um, every guy, everybody else, enter one if you can hear me, make sure. So we have thousands of clients all throughout the world, and I want to talk to you about how we acquire them on LinkedIn and the strategies we use. We're going to provide you with the marketing scripts and everything as well behind this. So I'm going to close my screen here, and we're going to get started right on LinkedIn. Um, we're going to make this very simple for you guys. This is how you're going to acquire new clients if you haven't already gone out. So we're talking about the wholesale industry for buying and selling consumer electronics. Again, if you have any questions, leave them in the group chat right here. We'll get to them immediately. I want to talk to you about how you connect with people because you can't just reach out and say, what do you buy? What do you sell? You need to build relationships. If you think about your best customers. They're probably also your closest friends as well. So with that being said, I'm going to show you how you can reach out to these people and how you can build a relationship and more so of a friendship as well. So yes, this is uh, recorded as well. Um, wholesaling guys, we're buying and selling uh, large, large quantities of consumer electronics. That's what we're talking about right now. So 95 people on board, guys. I really appreciate it. Let's dive on into this. We're going to be talking about exactly how to acquire customers. If you guys want to start from somewhere, you can always start on my profile. That's the easiest way to go. But we're going to be talking about, let's just do phone repair because that's a pretty common keyword right here. I'm going to go through the process that we use to acquire customers. Initially, we do a search. So keyword searches, uh, phone repair, wholesale phones, buy iPhones in bulk, any sort of thing like that are relatable to the industry. But I want to talk to you about how you can acquire new clients. You can contact directly to the people, as you can see, that are your friends right now. These are your first connections. Or we can go to all brand new connections, which I'm going to talk about. So we're going to go to connections here, and I start with second. So we can go to second here. And guys, yeah, let me show you. This is all free stuff, too. You don't have to invest any money in this. I don't suggest doing any automation. Build your profile the right way. You'll be recognized on social media soon enough. Second connections here are people that are friends with your connections, but you're not currently friends with. On top of that as well, we go to all filters here and we go to the industry. So we wanna make sure telecommunications, consumer electronics. One thing that I dabble in a lot that does well is uh, wholesale as well. So you can type in other things like computer, if you do computers, computer hardware, all of those types of things to enter in as well. And we're gonna apply those in that case. We're going to pull up all of these initial contacts. So you guys, obviously, most of you guys know how to do that. If you haven't seen that as, uh, so far, uh, these are really well verified searches uh, that you can go through. And we're going to go into more detail about how you reach out and contact these people um, as well. So here we go. The first thing you want to do is connect and reach out to them. Uh, what I want to talk about here is adding a note. It's always extremely important to be adding a personalized note. So for... Um, I don't honestly know his name on in that case to say, Hey, on, I see you're in the electronics industry. We buy slash sell, um, smartphones and tablets. <clears throat> Can I get your inventory list? So something as simple as that guys, I always usually, uh, leave with a question as well. 
So in that case right there, we can send that invitation. This is a very personalized approach to reaching out to people. You can go through this and do the same thing. I'm gonna show you in just a minute after you create a connection with them, things that you should be doing on top of that as well. So guys, again, 95 people in this, I really appreciate you. If you have any questions, leave them in the group chat. We're gonna be talking about them as we go. Okay, so one thing I wanna talk about here is going and working with people in the industry that are already well known and connecting with their suppliers. Everybody asks me, hey, now do I get in contact with your suppliers or your dealers? Well guys, I can tell you a lot of the people who work with me are directly on LinkedIn. I'm gonna show you some strategies right now that you can use in order to reach out um, to people that are already in the industry. So I'm on mo my profile right now, it's very easy. I'm gonna go on a popular person. Many of you guys might know this person. I don't really work with him at all, but um, he's a massive marketer on, on LinkedIn, especially in this industry. So you guys can uh, pull a lot of information off of Victor's profile to say the least. But the one thing I wanna show you right here is going directly to their mutual connections. So we're gonna to go to their mutual connections right here. We can go to Victor's mutual connections. The first connections are people we are all directly related, or we are all directly connected with already. So these people I'm already friends with. The thing we can go to though is second connections. We can also in this case break it down if you guys are only in the United States, the United States as well for companies you wanna work with. We're left here with 441 companies that majority of them are directly in the industry as well um, and we can contact them. These are people who are already connected with um, other people we know as well as Victor who's already in the industry as well. You can contact these people directly and start to uh, reach out to them. So you guys, uh, let me know if you can see my screen. Press a one if you can see my screen. Uh, just to make sure, okay, cool. I wanna make sure and make sure uh, on top of one if you can hear me. If you're having any issues, press a two. Press a two if you're having any issues. Um, other than that, cool, perfect, sounds good. We're good, guys. So most importantly here, what I wanna talk about, um, we're gonna dive into the last thing as well is reaching out to these people once you connect with them. I showed you a couple strategic ways to connect with people, including the people that I work with. It's very easy. If you guys wanna do the same thing, you can go to my profile. I got like 12,000 people in this industry that I'm connected with. So you can just reach out to them directly and start there. It's a really good, really good stop. And I just wanna shout out to everybody. Thank you so much for everybody being on here. We just hit 100 people on the live right now. I really appreciate that. That is awesome, so I'm. thank you so much for taking the time to do that. Um, what I'm going to do now though is I'm going to dive very, very deep into how you connect with these people after, you ex after they accept your friend request. So I can tell you guys, we do this very aggressively. You can see this just today, and this isn't just today, we do this every single day. The day before, the seventh, as you can see, we're very aggressive. We do 30 to 40 a day. That's the most that I suggest in that case, um, just because you don't want to get banned on anything. And guys, who's, whoever's asking you to start with a small budget, uh, this marketing stuff, you don't need to spend any money at all on this. You can just do it yourself. We're talking about as it goes for a small budget for wholesaling, it's a little bit harder. Um, so what we're going to be talking about in this case is reaching out directly to these people. I'm gonna to go to my network and I can go to my people that I've recently connected with because those are the people that are most interested in what I have to offer. So hit mobile right here. I haven't talked to these people specifically. What I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna show you guys how we reach out to them. We don't just message them because that's what everybody else does and that's a horrible way to go about that. Okay, that, that's the worst way to go about it in that case. So we can actually, I'm gonna do this for fun. Fella, I'm gonna use you in this case. We're gonna pull up Felden. This is what we do if we were trying to acquire Felden as a customer and we want him to reach out to him. If you guys ever use LinkedIn, odds are that um, not a lot of people respond to you because the fact is everybody's just spamming left and right and just saying, hey, you wanna buy my stuff. We don't do it that way. Check this out, this is how we do it. We reach out to Felden here. The first thing that we're gonna do in this case is we're gonna go and endorse him. People love that and they also get notifications. Um, every time you endorse somebody. So we're gonna endorse him for multiple different things. We can see other people have endorsed him too. This will get him a lot of attention. This will give us a lot of attention off the bat as well. So we can do three, you can do more, anything like that. So that's a great start to get their attention. The second thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna go to their articles 
their articles are the like blogs that they posted and you can like each one of these articles. This is going to be very beneficial because they'll recognize that you liked as well. You can leave a comment below too if you'd like. This is going to give a lot of attention. On top of that as well, you're going to go to the post section and you're, oh, look at that. Isn't that convenient? You're the man, Feldon. Um, you're going to like this as well and say, and you can always comment on there too. <clears throat> so guys, I highly suggest going through, like I said, liking, commenting on the things that he has to, that he's posted right there. What I'm going back to, I'll go back to Feldon's profile. Like I said, we just endorsed him. We just liked his articles. We just liked his activity right now. And now we're going to send him a message. So the message we send, I'm actually going to pull it up for you guys. I have one put together already um, that we are regularly sending out. I'll pull it up and give it to you guys. In just a second here. If this is helpful, press a one. Just press a one, guys, if this is helpful. If you want me to talk about any other topics, uh, let me know. Press a one if this is helpful. Two, if you want me to step my game up and I need to go on another level with you guys. Um, but one, if this is helpful, like I said, all right, awesome, sounds good. Um, we are now at 102 users, guys. I greatly appreciate it. So I'm gonna pull up this cold outreach here. This is the simplest one I've ever used. Two things I highly suggest. Okay, M's millions, I'll step my game up. Thanks for the honesty, I appreciate that. Um, I'm gonna post this right here, guys, in the group chat. You can go ahead and copy this right now at any time. So it says, hey, I see you're in the electronics industry. My team and I focus on, on helping companies acquire devices. So you guys, in this case, say we buy and resell consumer electronics and we want to work with you. It's, is this something that you're interested? And then add your phone number right there. I highly suggest two things in this case. First off, the first two sentences, just recognizing what you do and, and telling the things you do. Always ask a question. You ask a question that requires somebody to engage. And then leaving your phone number specifically for WhatsApp really gets people um, you know, engaged because that's another form of contact where they can contact you directly. We do this and we have a very, very high success rate. Now, there's a lot of people, especially Feldon, he's busy all the time. So he's not able to respond. And there's a lot of people that we can see. Excuse me, guys, one second. <clears throat> there's a lot of people that we can see, um, see our messages, but do not respond. So we have follow-ups as well, where I can post a follow-up um, just for you guys here. So, uh, hey, Feldon. I know you're busy, just wanted to follow up, up and see if I can get your inventory list. Send me a message and you're available. So guys, just something as simple as this. The this is not about the message. There's no specific way to talk to people. Everybody knows how to have a conversation with people. Just have a normal conversation with people and ask them these things. It's more important that you message them every other day or every single day and follow up with them until you get a reply. If the reply is no or stop messaging me, there you go. You got your answer. You can move on from there. But this is the strategy that we use. So every single person that we go through this messaging ends a very large majority end up responding. Some are interested, some aren't interested. Some end up signing up for our accounts immediately. Many of them say thank you for endorsing as well. So this is a lot of strat this is a great strategy that you can use to go out and acquire new clients through LinkedIn. Now guys, I have something else that I want to show you as well, which is another strategy we're using. Um, I'm going to see if I can scroll through here and answer any questions. If you guys have any questions, make sure you uh, to put them in there. If we're already in, in, in another industry, do you make a new one dedicated to this industry? No, you don't need to make a new profile at all. Um, just make sure, like I own multiple different companies. So I'll go under here. Um, you guys can see on my profile specifically as well that I have whiteboard club and then we're doing trade and tech stuff right now. And it really doesn't matter. Oh, nice. Loving the golden nuggets. I appreciate it. Well, I stepped my game up. Thanks for that. And so any way to create a step-by-step -step sheet, Mike, um, you know what, just sit down uh, right now. You can use my first one that I've put together as well. Uh, this one right up top, say, hey, you're in the electronics industry. Um, and then sit down and, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, just write out the steps-by-steps -steps that we've followed. This will be recorded and you can watch it again, record the steps. 
um, step by step. It's a lot of info though. I can tell you just like you said there. So guys, if you have any questions, leave them below as well. I got a lot more. We got 105 people on right now. So I really appreciate it. Uh, what kind of margins do you recommend for working on if you're transitioning from flipping locally? Guys, if you want to go bigger scale, um, it's going to be 10% or less. So you can probably scale up to about a half a million dollars. Um, you know, I would say every single month at 10%. Wow, that sounds like crazy to a lot of people. You know, it's actually really realistic in this case. Um, and so um, anything over 500,000, if you want to take it to like 10, 15 million, like we were doing about uh, 1.2 million a month and we were sitting on like 6% margin. So it was smaller, the volume was bigger, we were making money and stuff, but um, that's just the way it works. When you scale, that's how um, it happens. So did you say that you would be posting the messages you send? Uh, yeah, Melissa, if you scroll up here, guys, I'll post a few more. I'll post it one more time um, on the group chat. <clears throat> and so there you guys go. Um, I got banned from eBay and most direct buyers are paying similar prices to what I buy my inventory for. How do I sell it for a quick profit? Uh, Timothy, it's all about making the relationships. You need to talk to people who are going to be more aggressive. If um, they're all paying the same prices that you're paying, I hope you're making margin selling to somebody who's higher. But it really comes down to making those relationships. How you're going to get the absolute highest price is selling directly to consumer. I know you got banned on eBay, but you have accessibility still to go on Swappa and other platforms as well. So I post, I put everything on there and so... Um, yeah, how do you get the phones and sell them? Cash Flash, have you been watching like the last 10 minutes? I'm just kidding, man, but um, no worries. Uh, so reaching out to these people directly, I'm gonna show you how to reach out to other people as well and bid on their inventory list and everything. Guys, let me turn the lights on here one second. Hold on. All right, cool. Perfect. So guys, the next thing that I want to talk about here and help you guys out with is acquiring clients another way. If you have any other questions, leave them below. If this is helpful as well, leave a one below. If you want me to answer anything, leave them below. So uh, phone daddies, here we go. When, when you deal with a supplier filling orders or for buyer, do you house product or are you willing to ship directly to customer and trust the quality control? I always house the product. I don't trust the quality control of used items at all. There are a few companies. We sell cellular, I will mention, is a very, very good company. They have very high quality control, better than anybody in the industry. So I don't, you don't really need to uh, test their items in that case, but I highly suggest testing other people. Guys, for anybody who's in the industry, do not drop ship. I mean, if some people can be successful and you have close relationships, if you're brand new, don't even try that. Uh, it, it just ruins the industry how many brokers there are, are out there. Um, how much capital do you need when getting started flipping in bulk? The more, the better, to tell you honest. If you want to be uh, like aggressive, $20,000 is good. You can start with $5,000. Uh, but $20,000 will get you warmed up. If you want to play with the big boys, $100,000 will get you a couple bigger orders. And then you're going to be stepping into the millions if you want to go corporate and enterprise with companies like Verizon, AT&T, and all those types of stuff. So guys, if you have any other questions, open up the chat and post them right here as well. I'll be answering all those um, for you. Um, if this is helpful, leave a one too. I really appreciate everybody who's involved. We've got 108 people on right now. How do you get the best prices to sell on eBay? That's all about making the relationships, connecting with people. Guys, I'm going to show you a next strategy that I have here for connecting with people. Speaking of that, um, a lot of people follow me for my marketing strategies. They know me for my marketing strategies. So I'm giving you some free stuff here. Hopefully, it's really, really helpful to you. Um, so do you work with broker in China or deal directly? Um, we, we sell to Hong Kong and areas of Shenzhen as well. Um, so yes, but we do not um, really import anything into the USA at this time. There's plenty of companies that do. You can meet with manufacturers there as well, but not in the uh, electronics industry. So guys, keep leaving messages here. We got 108 people on, so there's a lot going as well. Let's dive into the more important stuff though on how I can find you more customers. So we're gonna go to phone repair on Google instead. So everybody's like, oh, hating, you're searching on Google? That's weak. Um, well, first off, guys, I'm going to show you this strategy behind here. As you can see, there's a ton of people in our area. You can go one by one and contact all of these people. In your area, there might not be as much. I'm in uh, Los Angeles area down in Orange County, actually. There's a lot. So if you want to go out there, go reach out directly to these people. But guys, let me show you a way more efficient strategy to finding this type of information online. I'm going to introduce you to a program. It's called Marketer Magic. I do not own this. I'm not doing any affiliate stuff for this, guys. Um, I'm just telling you this stuff because this is 
super valuable. So if you guys know the entrepreneur, Kevin David, he's really, really popular. Let's see if we can, um, like this guy, he does Amazon courses and everything like that. This is actually his company. I'm good friends with him. I know him. Uh, he's a cool guy. I'm going to show you how you can pull all of this data a lot easier. So he has a tool in here. It is called mini leads. I'm going to pull up mine right here. You can go to the side here and you can just go to mini leads. What this is, is this is directly uh, connected with the Google Places API, the API that same matches with Google Maps in this case. So I am going to show you guys how you can quickly pull some information. I'm gonna answer a couple questions as well on that. So if you go under Marketer Magic right here, you can go and create a new campaign. All you have to do is type in the location and a keyword, that's it. So we're gonna go on here, we've made hundreds of these guys and if there's a reason why we made hundreds of of these because it works and so in this in this case right here as well we're going to talk about Los Angeles we use Los Angeles in this case and a phone the keyword was phone and Los Angeles was the location so the same thing you would have typed in Google as well guys when you enter in this it will pull all of the data of all of these companies okay so right here alone we've done this there are 487 companies related to phone on Google that are active on Google Maps as well that you can contact directly here. This gives you a super advantage when it comes to reaching out to these types of people on here. So if this is helpful to you guys, press a one right now. Let me know. I'm going to answer a couple of questions and I'm going to go deeper into this as well. So um, how do you get rid of phones quick as possible? Normally it takes a while to sell. Cash flash, you want to do pre-orders. People have price lists, they'll buy in advance. If you build relationships with other people, you can do pre-orders, so where it's already pre-sold. We don't really like buying devices at all unless they're pre-sold because we wanna focus on acquiring more devices and since we already have them sold, there's no point um, you know, in trying to make a more of an effort to sell it for a couple dollars more. It's more about the relationship. How do we get around second dealer, uh, secondhand dealer licenses? Uh, do we need to obtain one? Steven, it all depends on what you uh, run. So pawn shops do have regulations for what they have to do. Um, it, it all depends. What you need to have is a uh, business, definitely um, form a business, whether it's an LLC or a corporation. And then from that point on, you can get business license as well. Um, and you will have to get up the other things that are required for your state, whether it's a reseller's permit, whether you need a dealer's license as well and have to hold the items for a certain while. There are certain limitations. I can tell you though that most of the industry buys and resells, they don't have holding standards for smartphones. So have you found that prices are different once the relationship is built? Of course, it is way different. Guys, I'm gonna tell you, if you wanna play with the big boys, like We Sell Cellular, they're a $100 million company. They're the parent company of You Sell. They are also partnered with Brightstar, which is um, a company, uh, well, which is the company that manages all the devices that are traded in for Apple. So um, we sell cellular. We had to spend about a quarter million dollars with them before we start getting better discounts than everybody. That's how it works. If you want to play with the big boys in that case, after that, it started to work out really well, and we started to make a little bit more margin on that. So if you guys, again, if you have any questions, leave them down here. I'm answering all of them right now. For me, okay, Feldman, thanks for answering those as well. If you got anything, please enter them in. Uh, Nicole, thank you very much for joining. Guys, if you don't know Nicole already from Cellbotics, she is awesome. So shout out to Nicole, I really appreciate it. Uh, would you recommend visiting these places in person or calling or email? Every single one of them, Eric. Uh, in person will make the best relationship. Calling will make the second best relationship. Email, you probably won't get a reply. So call them or meet in person. Email to follow up once you've already made a connection. What kind of software and where can we get it that checks the phone's functions for us? James Plank, um, phonecheck.com. So just tell them that uh, Hayden Howard with Trade in Tech referred you. So this company does uh, device uh, checking. So it's not cheap. I can sell the, it's definitely an enterprise company, but they can help you out with that. So phonecheck.com, you can check that out. Tell Hayden sent you. Should I go to thrift stores if, if I still don't have much closed leads? Um, I don't suggest thrift stores. I suggest pawn shops. Um, you can also go to uh, authorized resellers like Verizon, AT&T, Metro PCS, Sprint, Boost Mobile, all of those. Um, I feel like buying and selling to customers is the time and energy and with the business, it's much, much easier. Correct me if I'm wrong. I feel like buying and selling to customers is... Yeah, so you're right. Selling to uh, customers directly is a lot more time consuming, uh, but there comes a point where companies need to diversify and scale. So we were doing wholesale, we were doing five, 600,000 a month. 
But if one buyer fell off, you know, that might be very detrimental. We want to take it to the next level. So we expand on to like Swappa and eBay and Walmart and all those platforms. So we had diversified income and it really gave us a, you know, a solidified platform to scale on in the industry. So guys, again, 105 people on here. This is awesome. I, I greatly appreciate everybody on here. Uh, right now, what we are on, if you guys remember, it's Marketer Magic. So um, Marketer Magic, you can pull all of this information. I'm gonna be talking a little bit more about it. We'll talk about pre-orders as well in here just a second too. So Marketer Magic right here. You guys can pull the name. You can go to the website. You can pull the email, the phone number, the address. You can connect your SMTP and send an email as well and pull all their social media accounts here. So if you wanna get in contact with, let's say somebody good here, you break iFix, they are massive. We worked with a ton of different you break iFix, same with CPR and all those companies as well. So you guys can go on their website and contact them. You can call that phone number. You can contact them directly on LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, okay? And you can go into their store. You wanna close a client, that's how you do it. You have to do all of the following, not just one. And if they don't follow up, it's probably because they have 100 more of you who are doing the same thing. So it's about following up time after time after time. A strategy we use is called uh, the rule of seven, which means it takes an average of seven times for somebody to see your advertisement before they trust you and actually want to establish a relationship with you. So guys, I'm gonna answer a couple more questions on this. You can pull all this information on marketermagic.com and this is using mini leads right here. It's very efficient, it uses the same API that uh, Google uses. And these guys charge like 47 bucks a month for this. It's a no brainer. So, hey, uh, okay, here we go. Could you elaborate, uh, Jeff hit, so could you elaborate on how to establish pre-orders with buyers and sellers versus bidding on a, on a lot to sell on the open market? Okay, when you want to, uh, pre-orders are very, very hard when it comes to buying. Just because inventory shifts so fast, um, it's very hard to keep track. Quality control changes all the time, so quantity becomes, you know, inconsistent. So it's very hard to get pre-orders. Um, you can, you know, but it's really just relationship built only where people reach out to you directly and say, hey, I have this coming in, can you take it? And you say yes or no. When it comes to selling, you need to work with people who either have price lists or are, are willing to establish a set number. We provided price lists and set prices to our people who are willing, uh, willing to sell to us consistently and those were the prices that we were willing to pay all the time. Um, so I highly suggest relate, reaching out to people. Uh, there's quite a few people on this chat already as well. If you're a person that buys all the time, just say yes. You can put your phone number and information in here, guys, too. Go ahead and promote yourself. That's fine. Uh, just to help everybody else get started. Uh, how can I build relationships with some of the smaller authorized resellers in my state that some of the bigger buyers are not working with? Um, Okay, guys, so I just went over quite a few different ways. First off, you can reach out to the authorized retailers right here. You can use a keyword in that case as well to reach out to them, authorized in that case, or you can type in Verizon or Sprint or Cricket. Um, so first thing you need to do is you need to contact them in every single way that I've talked about. Um, going in in person, website, uh, phone number, email, social media accounts like their stuff, comment on them, make friends with them. People buy from you, people work with you because they like you, not because you have the highest price, because you're easy to work with and they like you. So if you can do that and build those relationships, you will do very, very well. This doesn't happen overnight, guys. We are sending out these messages on LinkedIn, like I had mentioned before. We're sending out 30 to 40 a day, every single day. You know, it might not get anything the first day or the second day, but we send out 900 to 1,000 a month. I mean, we get a lot of action and a lot of clients from that. Um, so keep going, guys. I'm gonna answer a couple more questions and then we're gonna uh, go through just a few more things um, for you as well to help you out. So basically getting products to be sold with other businesses instead of working with customers is easy. <laughs> uh, yeah, working directly with businesses is a lot easier and they can take a lot larger quantity and they'll buy from you consistently all the time. Uh, but it is also good to expand on platforms like eBay and Amazon and other types of ways in order to increase cash flow in different areas and balance out the business. Anyone in the Atlanta area, there's got to be some people. Okay, you said LinkedIn and Marketer Magic. That's correct. Guys, how do we find wholesale auctions? There's not really a ton out there. Bstock, liquidation.com. Um, I would suggest Bstock in that case. That's about the best. 
And that other than that, the stuff I'm putting out, guys, nice, Felden, I love it. Everybody who's seeing the information, if you want to connect with people, go ahead and put it on there. Do you need a price sheet when you approach local businesses and pawn shops? That's a great question, Eric. Um, guys, shout out to Eric Jacob as well. If you guys don't know him already, check him out on Facebook. He's an awesome dude, provides a bunch of value as well, and he's on YouTube. So good guy to work with. So do you need a price list when you approach people? I never give anybody a price list when I approach them. I always ask for the inventory or if what they're buying and try and make offers. People who request price lists, I'll provide it to them. Or I might provide it after we've made a relationship and we've built a business. So Nicole, she's in Atlanta too. So do you have a price list when personally reaching out to these stores? Um, provide the price list, like I said, after you build the relationship. How do you sell on Amazon? Uh, you sign up on Amazon.com. Uh, it's very, very difficult to get on there, though, for a resale in the electronics industry. You cannot sell Apple. It's very limited on permissions. Uh, resellers, like renewed accounts are selling for hundreds of thousands of dollars, if not millions now, too. It's very tough to get on there. Uh, I would focus on eBay and Swappa to begin if you want to do a consumer here. Uh, your link, so, okay. Uh, can you give an elevator pitch of what you would say if you walked into a store in a pawn shop? Heck yeah, heck yeah. Okay, MH, here we go. Hey, my name's Hayden. Uh, I buy and sell consumer electronics. I've uh, been working with companies. So let's say they already know some companies. I've been working with this pawn shop and this pawn shop in the local area. They've sold me devices like smartphones and tablets. Um, I am more than willing to pay you in cash and pay you up front every single time for the items and buy from you regularly. And I have pr price lists that where you can uh, schedule out to sell to me in the future. Um, I just seeing how we can do business, what we can get going and uh, really get going from there. So guys, if you just keep it as simple as that, be personal, reach out, you'll do well on there. Top 10 wholesale as well. Jonathan, thanks for being on there. Shout out to Jonathan as well for top 10 wholesale guys. He's a great guy, a great partner of ours as well. So sorry, I didn't mention that, man. I should, I got to step my game up. I know I will approve. Okay. In this case, so guys, more information on there. You suggest selling game consoles. Uh, game consoles move. Everybody has their niche. So obviously there's tens of millions of dollars, if not hundreds of millions of dollars, game consoles sold, you know, every single year throughout the world. So yeah, there's a huge industry for it. You need to find your niche though. We didn't sell a lot of them. We focused on smartphones and that case is very beneficial as well. So guys, we still got 104 people set up on here. This is phenomenal. Uh, what we've gone over so far is LinkedIn, how to reach out to people directly. Um, so how to add people as well was the first one and then how to reach out to them directly and follow up with them as well. If you guys want access to more of my content, more of my follow-up scripts, you can just send me a message on Facebook. It's just Hayden Howard, any one of those as well, either my personal or my public account, I'll be able to help you with that. Uh, James, I'm just retired now. No, man, I have a huge business. If you guys want to talk about it, we will in just a minute. I actually run two companies. I have like 16 people on my team. It's crazy. Um, so guys, I thank, thanks for all, all the credit. So why did you get out of the biz? Uh, I actually ended up selling my company and I was at the point where we doing like, like I said, 1.2 million, about 15 million a year we were doing, 1.2 million a month. In order to scale to the level I wanted to was about 50 million a year. It required a ton of cash flow. Um, I got an offer to buy my, to, for a person to sell my company. We were the top, the number one swap the seller and a, a Walmart DSV vendor. And I ended up taking the deal and it, I'm very happy with that. And I'm now I'm able to help a ton of people out and not hold this stuff back as well. So I have one Verizon employee that I have bought from in a few months. I approached a new Verizon store for sales thing and they said, absolutely not as is against the policy. Um, you know what? I would have to see in that case. We work with Verizon authorized retailers and it was not against the policy to sell those devices and work with people in that case. They might be a corporate store, so it might be a different situation. You're going to have to check on that, Ryan L. Uh, so <laughs> thanks for the, thanks, James. I appreciate that. So the, when the business is rapidly growing, what structure and system should you put in place when, it's, when, uh, when you're buying and selling in bulk so that things don't fall through the cracks. So number one, most important thing is inventory management. Uh, guys, I will show you somebody right now. I don't believe he's on here, but if you need this, you can just tell, say Hayden sent you. Wholesale is a great inventory management system for this industry. It's serialized tracking as well. Very simple to track all of your profits. So that's the first thing that you need to have ready. On top of that, you need to have a CRM as well. So we use a program, it's called Pipe Drive. I'll just show you guys my CRM. It's absolutely crazy because we manage so many leads. Um, so right now you can see we have 810 leads for $47,000. We do software, so it, it's recurring in that case on a monthly basis. 
So these are all of the leads that we have organized here. I suggest you put a CRM together as well. These are people we have coming in. So a CRM inventory management is very important. I cannot stress how important it is for you guys to save all of your customers' information. Whether I'm talking their name, their phone number, their email address, their website, all of that. Because all we do is follow up pe with people and follow up with people and it's extremely beneficial and we generate you know a ton of revenue from that and it's it's our entire business pretty much we don't need to do anything else because our industry is so large and our network is so large now so what are some popular profitable niches in this industry guys if you want to <laughs> get competitive the number one most profitable item i ever sold was a google pixel phone um, and I sold that to consumers. Great margins on those. Wholesalers can't sell them as well. Google Pixel phone did very, very well. And of course, iPhones sell like crazy. Um, so yeah, that's the, my number one most profitable was Google Pixel. If you want to talk about other things where people are making money, uh, they're making money in manufacturing a lot of different items. So it's a lot harder in the electronics industry to make money in reselling. It comes into ma manufacturing in that case. So I know a lot of people do white label um, stuff or do private label, you can call it as well, where they buy products from other people, other companies, and then they put their name on it and they resell them on platforms like Amazon and eBay. So that's kind of the next level. And if you want to talk to me about that, you can always reach out to me on Facebook. We're on my LinkedIn right now as well, guys. And so you can just go um, Facebook slash Hayden T. Howard. I'll be able to answer any questions you have. I, I'm on this every time. So just reach out to me. I'll be able to do that, answer that for you. Hayden, you need a video editor? I can edit videos for free. Uh, sure, why not, man? Uh, yeah, that sounds like a good deal. Uh, <clears throat> are the chats also included in the recording? Yeah, so this chat is recording my screen right now, and this chat's right here on the side, so you'll be able to get see that. Everybody hit up Jeff. There you go. Um, wholesale is amazing. Yep, I agree with that, guys. I suggest, again, wholesale is a great platform. Um, we have 110 people on here. Guys, thank you so much for joining. I hope this has been beneficial. If you want me to talk about anything, keep asking questions. I'm trying to go through as fast as possible. Um, how do you get into phone flipping in the first place, Hayden? One of my friends posted on craigslist.com, want to buy Xbox computers. 20 people hit them up, and we got it for half the price that sold on eBay, and it clicked in my head. And so we started buying every single electronic I could. We bought and resold on eBay, on Amazon. Then we ended up scaling and starting buying directly from businesses so we could take it to the next level. That's, that's how it started. So when I have under 5K, I purchase items locally from people. Yep, that's definitely a way to get started, Felden. Uh, so do you use private funds or only your funds uh, scale? So uh, guys, we've taken on lines of credit from most, multiple different private companies as well as banks as well. So um, we do take on, you can take on line of credit for scaling, but I only suggest doing that if you're profitable and I only do it as well um, if you already have a deal in place. Don't take money because you just want more money and you want to have more money to grow your business. You better have a deal already in the pipeline to take that money because borrowing money costs money every single day. Um, all right, guys. So what I want to do here, um, I want to dive into a few more things for you and talk to you guys. Um, we have released a platform. I've been working with Belden directly as well, and he's going to provide a bunch of links on this. Um, a lot of other people in the industry have probably heard about this, but they haven't seen it. I want to talk to you guys about it right now. So we actually released the brand new trade in tech platform here. Um, everything I taught you on here is the strategies we are using to acquire more customers and we are pushing them all to trade in tech. So we are getting anywhere from 50 to hundred people signing up every single day on this platform. This is what I want to talk to you about as well. We, this is a 100% verified platform for people. Um, and guys as well, if you want to get access to this, you can download the video. So in order to get access to this platform, you will have to go through a verification process where you provide references to get approved. We've been up for three weeks and we've had just over a thousand people um, apply so far. So we've had a lot of people approved as well and I wanna show you guys inside this. So Feldon's gonna provide links in the chats as well. You can go to Trade in Tech at any time and sign up. Uh, you will receive an email immediately when you sign up asking for a bunch of information. Okay, a bunch of, inf sorry, not a bunch, guys, just two references. It just asks for a few things in there. And once we approve those references and verify you, then from that point, you will be able to um, access the platform. So I'm going to dive in here and talk to you about what's going on in the platform. So let me lag here. Cool. All right, guys. So once you sign up, 
And again, Feldman has a link. You guys go on tradingtech.com at any time as well. Feldman, feel free to post that link as many times as you want in here. So you guys, what's up? Um, and so the first thing we have here is the newsfeed. This is very similar to other, all other social networks as well. So on this newsfeed, it's everybody posting their updates. You can see Eric, how he's posting about, we just shout out to Eric as well. Where do the reference have to be from? They have to be, so guys, a question on the references, I'm gonna answer that real quick. The references have to be from verified people you have already worked with in the industry. If you have not worked in the industry yet, you can provide eBay accounts, Amazon, Walmart, Newegg, or Swappa accounts with 100 plus positive feedback. This is a verified platform, so if you're brand new, it's gonna be a lot harder to get on. Should we trust buyers and sellers on trade and tech if we don't want to do uh, PayPal? We always suggest to secure your money. We monitor every single person. We also verify every single person. If you have any issues at all with any single person, you can click on their profile and you can report them immediately. We can report them right here. Uh, we have not had a single issue yet. We've done very, very well and people are very happy. So you guys can sc scroll through here. You can see people are posting their updates, their want to sell items. Uh, we posted, there you go, Felden. That's a little thing about him. What if you have a Bankari account? That's another platform you can sell on as well. That's great, buy and sell. So guys, we are posting constant updates and people are on here listing their inventory regularly. Uh, we want you to be involved. Again, Felden posts a link in here so people can have access to this. Um, we do charge $1 for the first 30 days and then we charge $59 a month. It's pretty much a no-brainer, guys, because we are in the wholesale industry. And if you acquire one client on here, it's going to make you plenty of money to pay the difference on that. We wanted to do that in order to connect to you guys in this case as well. So again, we have 105 people. If you have any other questions, leave them in there. I want to answer all of them. I'm wide open book. I'll answer any questions. Like, like I said, we're doing millions and millions of dollars in revenue in this industry. So I want to help you do the exact same thing. So guys, on top of that as well, we're going to go through here. You can go to the members section, add everybody. You can also go to your profile as well. You have your profile built out where you can rate people. You can go on other people's profile and rate them too. You'll have content updates here as well. You'll be able to go and see their listings and all of the blog content they've wrote as well on here. We have a ton of other things that we add as well. So it's amazing, great way to get out there and promote your brand. If you guys want the replay of this, we are recording this right now. Um, and so we will have it up on YouTube and everything tomorrow as well. And so you, would you recommend reaching out to private buyer for funds to purchase a local deal? Um, get fun. I don't suggest getting funds, you know, from anybody that, uh, first off, only take the money if you have a deal already sold. If you can raise money, that's fine, but pay attention to the terms. I see a lot of people taking PayPal money and all this other money. It's, it's like 25% APR, guys. So banks loan money at 6 to 8%. If you're paying over 10%, it's starting to get very expensive on your money. So just be careful where you're buying from. When operating on low margins, how do you protect your money when the market fluctuates? Focus on pre-sold deals only. For instance, when arson crashes. If you focus on pre-sold deals only, if you want to eliminate all types of unlock issues, stop buying based on unlocks and unlocking status as well. Um, I, you know, you can just buy permanently unlocked devices in that case. So it's all about limiting your risks and everything. When you buy devices that you have intentions of being unlocked, you take the risk of them not being able to be unlocked in that case. So guys, I want to go over a little bit more. You can feel free to ask more questions. I'll be able to help you out here. First off, like I said, there's not a platform like this out there. There are platforms and great companies out there, but there's no interactive platform with verified companies on here. You can list your company here as well and promote all of your brands and all of your products you have in our directory. We also have groups where you can connect with people and you can post updates in your groups, just like Facebook groups where you can control guys. So we have events too that you can go through. You'll see the updated events, event that uh, is actually going on um, here, I'll show you guys that we had. Oh, so one second. Well, actually, right now it's CES. So that's going on in that case. Uh, we have blogs as well, and we give you guys a super valuable information like how to buy electronics. We talked about that as, as well. And so um, what if you don't have references and want to start a new business? Um, Randy, I'm sorry, we don't approve people right now if they don't have references. Um, you have to have a verified um, eBay, Amazon, Walmart account that has over a hundred buyer um, buying requests um, or references. If you don't, I'm sorry, we can't approve you. How much do you sell your company for? Man, focus on your own money. It doesn't matter. 
it doesn't matter how much it doesn't matter how much I'm worth. It's not going to make a difference in your day. So my only goal is to make you as much money as possible, not me. Okay, so this is way more profitable for you than it is for me. I stay one one hundred percent unlocked for B two B. Okay, there you go, Chris. That's the advice. B two B is business to business. Thanks. I can't get trading tech. I don't have references. Guys, I'm sorry. Um, if you don't have references, you can't get in here. I want to help you as much as possible, but you need to be somebody and build build your reputation in the industry in order to get on here. We also have live chat rooms, which I want to talk to you about. So, um, Feldon, just keep posting the, the link as well. If you guys want to get started on Trading Tech, make sure uh, to just click the link. You can sign up uh, right now, and we'll get your account approved as well. So this is revolutionary compared to WhatsApp. I'm going to show you guys my WhatsApp. I have I'm in hundreds of groups hundreds and hundreds of groups. It's like ridiculous how many groups there are and they can only hold 257 people total. So all these types of groups I'm in, I think I'm in 300 plus groups. It's absolutely ridiculous. So what we've done is we centralized all these groups. We centralized everything so now everybody can communicate on a centralized platform. And it's also organized. As I had shown you on my uh, WhatsApp as well, we had, in this case, we had you know, all different types of groups, so unorganized. And now we've centralized it, made it simple and organized. You can connect with people. You can do video calls, phone calls, you know, reach out to them directly. So uh, I appreciate MZ Million. I appreciate that. If you guys have any questions about the industry, if you want me to give you any sort of information as well um, about how you can acquire new clients, do anything, just let me know. I'll help you out. I'm here for you. Just ask some questions. Do not be shy. Do not be shy. You can also put your contact information as well um, right there if you want people to reach out to you to buy and sell, whether it's on WhatsApp or your inventory list. Go ahead and be active on the group chat right now, guys. On top of this as well, I want to talk about the marketplace. You guys can buy and sell on our marketplace. We accept PayPal as well, where, or excuse me, you can accept PayPal as well, where you can pay directly or just contact the person. We charge no fees for this at all, guys. So you can sell on our marketplace. It is, it is so easy to sell. You just go like here and you make this short listing just like this. If you want to accept payment, just click that button and you can accept it right there. How to avoid sales tax when buying inventory on Swap and eBay. Um, uh, you have to set up, I believe there is something specific for eBay and Swappa. You're going to have to contact them directly and provide a reseller's permit. You're going to have to contact the company though. I don't know how to provide them that stuff, but you will need a reseller's permit so you don't have to pay that taxes. What should it know is flip do you with low money to start and work their way up? What should you know to flip, <sighs> phone flip, low money? Um, if you want, if you are starting with not a lot of money, guys, in this case, sorry, that question was a little confusing. If you don't have a lot of money uh, to get started in this case, I suggest buying from consumers directly locally and then moving your way up to businesses. Um, you can also take funding from other people in order to raise money, but I only suggest it for pre-capital. If you want to make the most margin on either way, it's working directly with consumers. If you want to scale quickly, it's working directly with businesses. So my main question is why has the CPO phone non-activated died out? Uh, that's uh, certified, you know, honestly, I couldn't even tell you because Apple swaps them out and they make money off it. It's so hard to find now. I, I know they're hard to find and they've stopped swapping as much. They just started uh, more so in this case, um, uh, just repairing the devices. That's why. And so guys, on top of this as well, we provide free training. So we actually did a training with Feldon yesterday on how he does over 100K a month. Uh, he went from like doing $50,000 a month all the way up to doing 100K a month in just a couple of months. And on top of that as well, if any of you guys want to work with us, we pay $75 for every single person who signs up. So you can sign up right now. Feldon, provide him the link as well. And uh, we'll, you guys can go on Trading Tech and sign up. Every single person that you refer, you just go here, use your link and you can copy it and you'll get access, uh, you'll get $75 for every single person who signs up. It's a really, really good deal. On top of that, guys, you can contact people directly on the message area here and you will get notifications and updates of everything that's going on. You can change your membership and your account settings here at any time. And this is the brand new Trade in Tech platform. So we've been going here for about 50 minutes, guys. I'm going to wrap it up here in the next 20 uh, minutes or so. 
if you want, get involved with Trading Tech. We got a lot going on. Uh, Feldon has a link right there and you guys can get started. Uh, like I said, we verify every person. So every single member in this case is verified and you can reach out to them directly and connect with them. There's a lot of conversations going on. And right now what I wanna do is I just wanna finalize and recap everything for you guys. Uh, for all of you who signed on a little bit later, you might've missed a few things. Um, you know, I, we will have a recording for this on YouTube. Um, you will get access to it um, tomorrow. And yeah, if you have any other questions, like I said, leave them in the group chat right now. You can pull the group chat up right here, go to more and then go to chat. Enter in those questions, guys. Don't be, oh, don't hold back. If you wanna ask me something, do it. Feldon, what's the price for game calls? There we go. Okay, guys, so like I said before, I'm gonna recap this. We talked about LinkedIn, how you can find new connections by doing keyword searches right here. So when you do these keyword searches, you want to set, select the location. You want to select connections that are your second connections. These are people who are related to your industry, um, who, but who are already friends with people you are connected with. And then on top of that as well, we're gonna go to more filters here, and we're gonna add this, and we're gonna filter out this. Whatever industry you're in, you can filter it down. Now we have really high quality people here. You can also reach out directly on other people's profiles. Just go onto my profile, you can connect with all my people. We're doing this every single day, guys. So you can connect with all of these people here, connect with them, always leave a note. Once you've connected with them, make sure to go through. You can endorse them, so we can go to the contacts here that we have. Make sure to endorse them. So you can go down here, you can endorse them for all of their skills. Make sure to like their articles and their activity and leave comments and then send them a message. Guys, I had a little script that I had put together for you already. Um, so here, I'll just send it right over again in the group chat. There you guys go. You can use this script, you can change it up a little bit, however you need to, related to your industry. It works very well. And then you follow up with them regularly. This converts very well. You need to do this consistently as well. So if you wanna start easily, just go to my profile or Feldon's profile, either one. We'll go to Feldon's in this case to make it, we can see if, does anyone see the script? So script's right above your message. Um, guys, if you wanna message me directly on Facebook too, I'll provide all of this stuff to you. Uh, we'll have all this information up as well and all this stuff in the description in YouTube tomorrow. So you guys can go to this. Again, 92 people still on here. We've had about 110 people at total that came on. And so guys, I'll, I'll provide the script to you on YouTube tomorrow in that case if you don't have access to it. Again, thank you everybody who showed up. My name is Hayden, I'm the owner of Trade in Tech and my only goal is to make you more money. That's our goal in this case. And so um, what, like I said, we can connect directly with Feldon right here. We can go to his mutual connections. In this case, we don't have a lot, but we can then go to second connections instead of first and see all the people, ooh, Felding, you don't have a lot. He's gotta step his game up, guys. Tell Felding to step his game up in the, in the chat right now so he gets it up. All right, guys, I appreciate it. Thanks for, so, and then you can connect with them directly on there. Tell Felding to step his game up, everybody. If you wanna get active on here, tell Felding to step his game up because he needs to step his game up. If we go to Victor's here, you go to the second connections, you can connect with all the people who are in the industry as well. That is the LinkedIn strategy. We also talked about Google right here, guys for you as well where you can get started. You can go on to Google, search these people. You wanna make it easier, use marketermagic.com, use many leads right here and you'll be able to pull all this information for your area. Most importantly too, get started on trading tech. If you guys uh, have any questions right now, leave a message below. We've got a lot of people already signing up for trading tech. It's, it's really good. So I appreciate everybody who's been on there and who's been signing up as well. Again, if you have any questions, just reach out to me on Facebook. I'll be able to help you out. Um, other than that, we'll leave this on YouTube as well. So guys, I'll show you one more demo. We have the whole entire platform here, the social platform. You'll be able to go through, set up your private members, every set up your membership profile. Every single member is verified on here as well. You'll then have a directory where you can post your business and all your information, private groups, events where you can attend, blog where you'll get a ton of updated information on how to scale your business. We have live chat rooms that will replace all of the WhatsApp groups entirely where people are active on there as well. And then you can go to the marketplace where we don't charge any fees. You can buy and sell with no fees. Nobody does that. Everybody charges fees and that's why it's so cheap. Uh, and that's why we make it so good for you guys. We make it cheaper. And so on top of this as well, you get free training. We'll update you with a ton of information. And 
if you ever want to work with us, if you ever want to partner with us, we'll pay you 75 bucks for every single person who signs up. So again, uh, thanks for the info. I'm kind of lost. I really just want to buy cheap phones and sell them. We were reaching on how to reach out to these people. If you guys want to learn how to buy phones as well, we'll provide a bunch more information. Uh, just message me on Facebook, reply to Felden. We do regular trainings as well, be breaking through. We just want to show you guys some strategies in which you can find more customers. Yes, eBuy smartphones, we pay $75 for every single person you refer to our platform that signs up. And so you can just go right here, get to 75. You got to sign up for a, uh, our account in order to get started. So Belden, make sure to post the, um, the link below. Guys, if you have any questions, we got about five minutes left on here. So I want to answer all of your questions. The sign up for Trade in Tech is only $1 as well. So you can get started for just $1. Then we charge $59 a month. You can cancel at any time on the platform as well. You don't have to contact us. You just go to the membership section right here. So guys, leave any questions below. Thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, shout out to everybody I know, all of my clients that I've worked with in the, in the past as well, and everybody I've been talking to regularly. I hope this has been beneficial. If you guys can leave a one below, if this has been beneficial to you, please let me know. And if you have any more questions, please leave more comments. Leave more comments, what I can do. We're gonna have this up on YouTube uh, tomorrow. Again, you need, in order to make money, in order to make this happen, you need to go out there. You need to be active on LinkedIn, on Marketer Magic, moving around, get on Trade in Tech. Send $1 to Hayden. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm talking about, you guys. So what email script, uh, what is your email script to local businesses? Nick, send me a private message on Facebook and I'll provide that with you. Highly recommend getting involved if you can. Thank you, I appreciate that, Ryan. We're I appreciate that, guys. Thank you so much for all the support, guys. LinkedIn, Marketer Magic, that's the way to do as well. Uh, guys, like I said as well, if you need help with this, uh, message Felden directly or you can message me as well. I'll be able to help you out and answer anything. Just do it directly on Facebook. For those people who asked as well about if you need inventory lists um, or inventory management, we talked about wholesale. I highly suggest that. And if you want to manage your customers, I talked about Pipe Drive, which is our CRM we use. This is crazy, guys. We do hundreds and hundreds of deals on this. And, and so um, on top of that, like I mentioned, Felden, click the link, use the link below as well um, and sign up under Felden's account and he'll be providing you guys with a ton of bonuses as well. If you have any other questions, please reach out to me. I'll be able to help you out. Guys, we are just about to close everything up right now. We have 80 people on here. So thank you every single person who's shown up. Uh, if you guys are interested in my contact list, people have talked about, um, we don't really talk about this too much. I'll just show you because we mentioned it. You can go to go.tradeintech.com. We do have our whole contact list where you can purchase. These are all the people we've worked with. Uh, we've done over $30 million with these companies. We provide a lot more. All the live trading groups, which I'll show you as well, which we run on WhatsApp. So uh, we just blast out. A lot of you guys would know about them. So all these trading groups we run with hundreds of people in there constantly posting too. So more importantly though, the big thing, like I had mentioned, is trade in tech. So getting involved on the trading tech platform. Guys, if you want my contact list, contact me directly. I'll be able to help you out with that. Um, on top of that, with trade in tech, if you guys haven't heard already, we provide 50 to 100 verified leads every single month to you guys. So you will be receiving these leads. This is the leads for this month where you can reach out to these people. It includes all of the uh, social networks as well, phone numbers, websites, all of that. So if you guys are too busy, have any questions, we provide all of this data to you on a monthly basis. All you have to do is pay $1, you can get this information right now. Go ahead and sign up on Trade & Tech. Um, if you have any questions, reach out to me on Facebook. Guys, we're gonna close this up right now. There are 75 people on here. Again, my name is Hayden Howard. Felden Richards is on here too. He put this together. Make sure to work with him. His company is NYC Phone Buyer and I back him 100%. He has done amazing things. So Felden, post a link to your website, all your information, uh, and make sure to post a link to Trade and Tech. Guys, get involved with the Trade and Tech platform. I wanna make you a ton of money. $1 is a no-brainer. $59 is a no-brainer. I will get you the clients. We are very, very good at this, and we have hundreds and hundreds, if not thousands of clients already you know, who are working with us directly. If you guys need anything else, please reach out to me directly. Other than that, I'm closing this up right now. So, Felden, put the link below for everything for people to sign up. Uh, guys, click that link right now. We're going to get signed up. Get on Trade in Tech. It's the only verified wholesale platform for electronics dealers. If you have any questions, please reach out to me. Um, again, thank you guys so much. We put together an hour-long training for you. Um, we're closing it off right now. Thank you so much for everything. I hope you guys have a great night.
Hey, leave a one below if this was awesome. If you guys like this, leave a two below if you want me to do this again. For all those people on there, leave a two below if you want me to do this again. Should I do this every week, every month, every day? No, I'm just kidding. I'm sorry. I can't do that. Maybe a tad slower. Oh, yeah, you're, you're right. We'll put the recording on there. I know I'm fast, man. I want to get level, level three if your wig was peeled back. <laughs> all right then all right guys i'm gonna try and put this together again if you guys have any questions reach out to me i'll be able to help you out as well uh thank you so much for attending i'm gonna stick on until you guys have left as well if you want to i right, sorry if i rattle people's brain we work a million miles an hour if you guys want to look at some of the campaigns we're running as well on trade and tech on uh facebook i'm going to show you those so yeah we we do super like paid advertising as well so all the brand new campaigns, we're turning them on tomorrow for you guys as well. So we got a ton of stuff going on here um, for these set up. We're gonna be uh, we're gonna be pumping a lot of con a lot of people your way as well. So you want to make sure get it involved on trade and tech because you know guys we spend thousands and thousands of dollars every single month uh, promoting our company. Shout out again to Top Ten Wholesale on here as well. You guys, you just click Consumer Electronics, you're gonna find here as well. We're sponsoring, we're paying all for this to get you guys more clients. So I like that I need to get my energy up. Taylor, go to the gym every single day, man. That'll get you energy up. Uh, Hayden, I paid, but I don't think I can, I can get verified. Cash Flash, if you can't get verified, don't worry. Just send us a message. Uh, we'll, we'll close everything out for you. And um, you know, maybe we can talk about something in the future and work something out. Guys, if you have any other questions, leave them below right now. I'm staying on here until everybody is logged off. We still got 64 people, so. I'm gonna help you out in this case as well. Um, again, sign up on Train Tech. Feldon, leave that link below as well to get these people started um, on here. So if you guys wanna leave your contact information, feel free to do it. Last question, on average, what's the ideal amount for an ad campaign? Um, I am doing CBO campaigns. I have five interest targets. So I do CBO campaigns, five interest targets per campaign. So I'll just select one here. And then actually I'm doing three in this case uh, for this one. But I, we're estimating we do $100 a day just for testing. And then at scale, we've gotten as much as to $800 a day in this industry. So um, if you want to test, I would say test on $100, $150 as a testing budget to get some data and then go from there. Um, so I will look, thanks Hayden, you guys are the best. Guys, leave a two below if you want me to do this again. Leave a question below if you want me to help you out as well. If you like this, just leave a one. If you want me to do this again, leave a two. On average, what's the ideal amount for, oh, excuse me. What was the marketing website again? We have marketermagic.com, okay? That is one of the main websites. We use pipe drive as well and wholesaler things we talked about. So how do you set effective goals? Set standards that you need to do. If you want me to set goals for you right now, add 30 people and message 30 people on LinkedIn every single day and call up 20 of these companies on Marketer Magic in your area every single day. Okay, that's 50 people a day. That's 1,500 a month. Trust me, you'll build a massive business. And you can use Pipe Drive to follow up with them regularly. Follow up with them every week and ask what they're buying. You can do it with email, text message, phone call, all of that. Uh, what... Should a person do with the low budget and flown fit thing to do to make a lot of money? Um, if you want to make a lot of money with a low budget, start directly with consumers. Buy from consumers and then sell to consumers on platforms like eBay. That's going to give you the most margin, but it's not scalable. That's the best way to do it. Hayden, uh, okay, sorry guys. Well, sorry, I was went way past here. <clears throat> 5K and above, would you do 100% B2B? Definitely, I love B2B in that case. Pipe drive, can you send mass text messages? Yes, you can. You need to have people verified on there. Thanks, Hayden, sent you an email. Uh, missed the references part. Sorry, man, I, I don't know what that is. You guys, send me a message directly if you have any questions. If this is helpful to you, like I said, leave a two below. If you want me to do, or leave a one below. If you want me to do this again, leave a two below. Felton, just keep posting the link, guys. Again, get involved on trade and tech. My only goal is to make you as much money as possible. It costs one dollar. We're gonna provide you right off the bat with a hundred, or excuse me, eighty-four verified companies, and this is just for this month. On top of that, as well, you'll be able to connect with everybody who's online. We got a lot of people who signed up already. We got a lot going on. I have people calling me right now and everything too. So if you guys have any more questions, leave them below. Ask a question. Click the link for Felden or go on tradeintech.com as well to get signed up. Um, guys, thank you so much for getting involved. I, I greatly appreciate it. This replay and recording will be 
on YouTube as well. The average margins was 6% for me and we were doing 15 million a year. So uh, at that level. Uh, how old I am? I am, how old am I? I'm 29 years old. I'll be 30 in a couple of months. Getting up there, man. I started this company when I was 22 years old and uh, we ended up scaling. Um, you know, we were, we went from about guys, just to give you an idea, we went from about 165K a month the first year, second year, 360, 365 grand. Uh, third year, we did 650 grand. Then fourth year, uh, we did 4.8 million. How can I speak to Hayden directly? Guys, if you want to work with me directly, um, I, we do have a, a program that we have for that. I don't have a lot of time. You know, we, we did, had over 100 people on this so far. So we've got a lot of people who are really engaged. I greatly appreciate the live going on. So um, if you guys want to contact me directly, send me a message that I can't really get on the phone unless you're in my mastery program. Uh, but send me a message directly because I reply to at least 100 to 200 messages every single day to help people out. So again, Trade and Tech is the only verified platform. Felden, man, put up all your information. If you guys haven't worked with Felden yet, make sure to work with him. His company is NYC Phone Buyer. Uh, he buys and sells. He runs a great company. He's gotten a majority of people on here as well. So he's phenomenal. And if you guys, like I said, if you have any more questions, just go up here to the chat pull up this information, I'll be able to help you. So were you paying yourself and your employees on 6% or is that after everything? That was 6% net for the entire company after paying all my employees and myself. So we were doing a lot of things from e-commerce, buying and reselling, all those types of things. So guys, again, if you have any questions, please reach out to me directly on Facebook. I'll be able to help you out on that. Uh, you can reach out to me on Instagram. Uh, and if you're on WhatsApp as well, you can talk to me as well. Uh, Felden, you, you ready to close this up, man? You ready to close this up? Sorry, I got you on mute, brother. Just let me know if you're ready to close this up. E-commerce is platforms like eBay, Swappa, all that. Can I have your WhatsApp? Yeah, guys, if you need my WhatsApp, here, I'll send it to you. Please do not call this number, though. Do not call this number. Guys, there's my WhatsApp right there. Okay, um, again, guys, we're closing off right now. We will have the replay up on YouTube tomorrow. If you have any questions, reach out to me directly. Uh, we went over LinkedIn. We went over Marketer Magic. We talked about Pipe Drive. We talked about Wholesale. Feel free to post your information in here as well. Uh, my what, contact me directly if you want my WhatsApp information and all that. If you guys have any other questions, I'm here to help you out. So thank you so much for watching everything. We are ending it all right now, guys. So. Uh, one last question. You got five seconds to do it. If you want to do it, go right here to the chat program. I buy more than just phones. Leave your information right here, guys. All right, cool. We're closing out. Thank you everybody so much. Make sure to check out my YouTube channel. Uh, you can just go to YouTube and you can type in Hayden. If you also go to YouTube here, you can go to phone flipping. Just type in phone flipping and Felden is actually a number one ranked person on phone flipping right there. So if you guys have any questions, reach out to me. I'll be able to help you out. Other than that, we are closing out. Have a great night.